Welcome to Smoky Reacts. I'm your boy Journalist. And on this one today, we have uh from Cayman or Kanan's channel called Confronting London's Most Hated Rapper. I got well, how many seconds in this bitch? Nine seconds into it, and it was like, oh, if I gotta sit through this, y'all gonna sit through it with me. Cause this is going to be a madness. So Thank you guys for joining me. Please do hit that like, subscribe, Patreon's in the description. And let's get into this and see what kind of fuckeries we have today. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, wine pun me, wine pun me, wine pun me. Wine pun me, cocky. Bow, 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 bow. Passive flow. Can't end up in here filming the documentary. I'll be in the streets, fucking up, yeah, we do it for free. So the camera that is. That is AC flow right there. Yeah, it's literally bloody fucking nobody apart from myself. Cause you know sometimes I get myself in trouble. Oh bro, you know, you know, bro's got the whap. What's your favorite whap? Oh, favorite whap, God. Uh, favorite whap, God. Probably a Smith and Wesson. Nah, I like the Kalashnikov. Kalashnikov's, Kalashnikov's got swag. You get down in the dirt with that one, and you yeah, can still sure. blow off heads. One's caught so many M's on that one. Yeah, right. he caught some. So many M's. I've got some kills <laughs> with that one. <laughs> <laughs> Kanye, what the fuck are you doing? What is this, my brother? I'm not hurting you. Who before. is AC Flow? AC. Archie Cardella, better known for his stage name Bessie Flo is a musician who blew up on TikTok for his new age music and his unique videos. Like most people on TikTok, however, he is not free from controversy. But we'll get on to that later in the video. What, what have I My brother reminds me, uh Kanan reminds me of Darkest Man done wrong you kissed a 16 year old girl right. we also met up with his brother chrome farts or ruben he told me to meet him at a place called gales a bougie starbucks and we arrived yeah. and obviously like because they know man and that like we can get like a little free they thing know. how are you it's gary <laughs> It's a she's whole the OG, she's the OG. On on my birthday, she did, she did that fucking on me tonight. Yeah, she fucking on me tonight. Oh really? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. She, she's OG, innit? <laughs> right? How did how did you two meet? <laughs> yeah. What was what was the dream? Oh, you don't want to. I don't want to know. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, guys. No, go okay. back. See you later. Thank you. Oh, you're already famous, man. Oh, bro. She had a dream about you. Yeah, man. It happens. It happens. <laughs> he's one of them niggas that I can see becoming famous But he's gonna be a demon He's gonna be a demon Cause he's a douche already Fuck but It's one of those You love to watch it Cause it's like what ignorance is this What have you got in your hands right now Right now I got a pan chocolat Girls pan chocolat it's not the sexiest looking one. What's this technique you're doing? You're like opening yeah, cause, up. Yeah, because basically, uh, yeah, you can manage that. I don't really fuck with the skin. Skin. Show up that bitch up, split in half. This one's looking a bit more flimsy than the other one. Bro, we're uber French, fam. Really? So nice. right, we're proper French. Our dad is uber French, bro. Uber French. He just takes Ubers everywhere, bro. Six, seven. Gang. Shout out Six Seven. <laughs> you know, man. one of my boys um, is actually a member of Six Seven, so yeah, I'm pretty. We're pretty tapped in. I've, I've known his name's yeah. SJ. My nigga Red Rums in the band don't all night whipping up grub. Our mum used to take him to like Madame Two Swords and shit. Yeah. Like, yeah. What's that? What's that song? Not Let's Lurk. Fucking. Now, and I'm gonna drill him at his front door. Bow. What's that one? Fuck. What's that one? <laughs> Fuck. Fuck the cool. He's such a <laughs> drill him at his front. Pop, pop, pop. <laughs> that's how it goes. Pull up on your block ten toes, my dude, no plan, my dude, no that's plan. The, the, nah, that's let's look. What's the craziest thing you lot have seen in this like in this, in this area? area? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I gotta get bored down on the mains. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Have you ever been in like any street fights? Oh yeah, I fight. If 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 but I mean look, look, look. I'll be the I'll be the guy to defuse the situation. There was this one instance where, back in Bath, right? <laughs> 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 
you know what it is when when you got you got young kids trying to fight and shit. You just gotta be like, look, bro, just chill. Because if like, anyone touches Ruben, Ruben, bro, I get rowdy. Like it's yeah, crazy. At Carney, at Carney, it's crazy. This year at Carney, he was walking, and obviously <coughs> I was trying to follow him, so I had like my hand around his belly, and then this big black dude, Yee. like this big black dude, pushes me like. Oh. What you do? What you do? Touch it, man, man. And I was like, bro. Did you see that? Yeah, 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 yeah. And I was like, bro, it's my brother. And he just fucking pushed me. We don't let them butt in my life. <laughs> I heard that a couple of times, bro. That shit was fuck funny, with bro. They just yeah. be like screaming it off. Good morning. Here comes the bag. What in the fuck? Show me what you wanna be. I can't handle anything. It shows how to get. And that's Slipknot. Holy moly. I'm about to throw up. <laughs> What's your favorite artist? Kanye West. Is Kanye? it? Yeah. That's yeah. Good. Kanye's good. Good morning. Kanye. I've had dreams of Kanye as well. Many. I had this one dream with Kanye where like, I was just hugging. I've had dreams of Kanye as well, many. I had this one dream with Kanye where like, I was just hugging him and he was just crying in my arms because like, <laughs> you, know? you feel like the Kanye of Fulham? <laughs> I mean, man, I'm AC Flow, innit? I'm Archie, you know? Shout out Kanye. <laughs> To the desk. What happened to the desk? Yeah. Anger. Some guy was like, uh, man, I missed the November AC flow. And like, I was like, uh, just started slowly eating away at me, bro. I'm just fucking bang that shit, bro. Yeah. Sure. Let's just cook up the heaviest, most disgusting Crap. trap beat ever. Yeah. You know, we're gonna cook up the most disgusting, filthiest beat. What makes a filthy, disgusting Long beat? Drums, AOAs. Also, just a fucking arrogant melody. <laughs> Thinking fast. Not quite a disgusting trap beat, but... K9, you're hopping on the beat, baby. What well, should be my bars? I don't know. I, I ain't got any bars. Kenan hopped on a beat. And with AC, yeah. Cooking up this beat. <laughs> this shit for free, huh? Chilling with the G's, made a documentary. <laughs> Tell what it is, and you know how it be. Chilling with the D, catch me winding that car knee. <laughs> I ain't winding. Oh. I'm catching the wine, but I ain't winding. Are you in like your flow state right now? Yeah, bro, somewhat. AC is flowing. AC is flowing. Technically, you're always flowing. I need to get sturdy on him, bro. Get sturdy. I can't get, I can't get sturdy. I can't get sturdy. Yeah, me neither. <laughs> try, try, try. Oh, oh. It's all about just playing with yourself. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Ah, cramp. Too much playing with yourself. Too much playing, bro. Yeah. Little pound chocolate type beat. Low latte, full fat this milk. Me like, Shout uh, out Comfort. Andrew Callahan. I'm motherfucking blood brother. Shout out Comfort. Where we oh, at, my, my blood brother? brother. <laughs> Where we at, we in the room. Shout my blood brother. Kenan, where we at, we in the room. Can I say that, bitch? Kenan? Kenan's hopping on the mic, Kenan. man. What's up, y'all? Kenan about to hop in. Yeah, we wildin'. We really wildin'. Yeah. Yeah, 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 you guys will just hear my voice without the music when I was singing. I know. Yeah. So I just really like that. Let me show you guys my room. My yeah. room. I cleaned my room yesterday. I was like, fuck, man, these guys are coming through. I gotta make sure it's looking clean. Girlfriend drew this for me. Um. <laughs> nice. Nice little voice crack. We, it was our anniversary, I don't know, six months, seven months, whatever. We, st we st stood in front of each other and we did a little drawing for each other with a little note. Yeah. She said, Dear Ruben, my darling munchkin, I am so grateful to have you in my life. I appreciate you so much, smiley face. I love everything about you. You're so handsome and give me crazy butterflies. Shit. Love from Louisa. Wow. It's cute, isn't it? It's 
so I popped that up English there to me. next to one of our bras. Well, I don't know what it is really, to be honest. Ooh. But yeah, this is the room. It's pretty cotch. At first, I called this song like, whoa, whoa, or whatever. And I was like, mm, kind of dry. And then I saw this picture of like a, a bear surfing on a shark. And then I was like, that's got to be called Sharknado, you know? And there's a film called Sharknado, so I just downloaded some clips. So this is what we got, this is what we got. How do you look at fly? They say that, that I'm not, ah, ah. Yeah, they say that I'm not guy, guy. And then there's this clip where we get chased by an elephant at the end. <laughs> that's Sharknado for you, bro. Why do you think I need a style change? Be honest. What I don't think you need a style work? change. I think it's just that for the occasion, you know, we got access to cool gear. We could get you fucking, you know what I'm saying, rocking out. Cold. I would sag a bit more. I would sag more, yeah. Like, literally sag. Why not? Bit more, bit more. Bit more? Bit more. Cold. <laughs> <laughs> Bad shorty, this fixing on this So you want me to pull up to the event like this? Yeah, I mean... We still try some yeah, yeah, yeah. Try these, but the thing is, this guy's tall, bro. Oh, yeah. Any words? I just feel cool. Mm. But to be fair, like the, I, I, I liked Waste the style the, that you had this, this morning, car. bro. Maybe I should just be myself, eh? <laughs> Real life is wild. We were born in London around Hernhill area. Lived there with our parents, went to school around those areas. Went to a French uh, primary. Was it primary or it was like well, a you're, you're nursery? So I was in nursery, but it was a French nursery. It's yeah. called Wix. Then we moved to France, and that's where we basically did, basically where I did my teens all the way up to 16. You know, Cannes is your hometown, you know, like running around, just doing what you do, like. We, moved, we lived in lots of different areas as well. I lived in a nice area called Pigoma, which is just Flat in the valley and like it's just nice. And there's like a nice river. Yeah. I loved living there, man. It was it was a nice place. Yeah. Back in the day when I was 16, bro, like I was blasting Gucci Mane like hard in my headphones. Like people don't know that. Bro, I used to pull up, yeah, my art teacher, like I used to have my hood up, bro, blasting Gucci, bro. Art teacher be like, Archie, put your head down. <laughs> Some angry teen, bro, like. <laughs> Can we um talk about the situation because just to explain it, because maybe like. So what would you like to know? Just like describe it in your words. The word itself is such a, it has such negative connotations that if I actually actively speak about it, it's almost like implying that that's true. One of the first controversies he went through was meeting up with a 16 year old girl and kissing her. He was 22. He also met up with another 16 year old girl, but apparently nothing happened. Yes, I did, you know, um, go on a date with a girl who I as assumed she was older at the time, whatever, you know, went on a couple of dates and then I wasn't interested anymore. Same with, with that other chick, you know, and all, that other chick, all we did was just hang out, you know, like Nothing for one day and like we didn't even kiss or not and it was just, also there was, also there was a lot of clout going on so I was just posting videos and kind of in that crazy mode. I don't give a fuck if she young, I don't give a fuck if by your standards that's not right. You know, I lost my cool, you know, also, like, I lost my girlfriend, so all my behaviors were just super reactive to my environment, and I was just fucking. I was a mess, bro. I look at pictures of myself then, and man, like, Nuts. I look stressed, bro. But are you fucking stupid, bro? Are you dumb? Look at her fucking Instagram and tell me she's just an innocent young child. Like, are you fucking stupid? The Don't main thing with all the Don't TikTok drama was just me, like, scrambling for whatever attention I had left to, like, make my music career go. But, like, it wasn't the right thing to do, you know? This is why I read these books, bro. I, I got all these books, man. But I read, I read, um, let me show this, man. This is all a bunch of bullshit right now. So this is a very crazy book. I mean, man, I don't, even, I don't even know where I'm going with this, but Charles, I feel like we said, I don't know. I think it's too this is all deflection from having to take accountability or deal with any seriousness the topic of what he's just been asked. That's why none of this shit makes sense. This is pure deflection. Too much. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Um. <sighs> it's hard to talk about. It's crazy. <laughs> you, you never know if you're saying the wrong thing, do you know what I mean? <laughs> I feel like it did. 
<laughs> Basically, fucking hell, man. So can we, can we, can we, can we just man, talk quickly about wait, the cameras? This, like, just like, and then we uh, can, we can just. Basically, the point is, is that like. We even were saying stuff online, and then I, I was like hot headed, just like Ruben was saying, we were in that time. I just said to Ruben, I was like, let's respond, let's respond. Oh, you piss you need off. A 22 year old to piss off. calm down. Nah, I'm not having this shit. She hit no. me up, you knew exactly what she wanted to do. I went out and linked her, and that's it. We kissed, no and then way. I stopped seeing her, and no I'm way. a pedo. Shut up, man. And I said to Ruben, I remember, I was like, I was like, imagine this backfires. Fuck it, let's do it. That was the state I was in, you know? Like, and so we did it, and, and, and then people took it, and I instantly felt like this sinking feeling in my chest. I remember going into my brother's room, and I was like, fuck, like, the, like this, is, this is just not what needs to be happening right now. Do you think people were hating on you because of the video, or like the actual situation? What would you say was like? It's gotta be both. Um, it's gotta be both. <laughs> yeah. Like, you know, like I said, I've had haters my whole life and the way I be sometimes, like, you know, it, it, it affects people. I want to put a disclaimer out saying it's not technically illegal in the UK to go out with someone who is 16. But is it immoral? Mark, huh? The, the, the age of consent is one thing, but when you were a grown man, once you were 18, what are you looking at anything that has a number lower than your shit? Like, that's crazy to me. Like... You have grown up pussy out here, and you still trying to chat the girl in primary. Not primary, because I don't know how your schools work out here in the UK. But, like, she's still in high school or whatever. Like, the fuck? You got gallus in college. Like, well, I guess not, because there's fucking, in the UK, there's fucking people that are, like, 16, 17 in college. So that doesn't work either. It's not America. Still, my point, you're 18. Don't be fucking no kids. What's wrong with you? Like, that's mad to me. Like, I don't give a fuck if age of consent in the UK is fucking 16. doesn't matter. The fuck? You're 22. Now, if she lied about her age and you didn't know, that's one thing. But apparently you you found out and didn't care and then thumbed your nose at everybody else for thinking that you're a nonce for what you was doing. That's That's not okay. At the same time, it's like, I can't even book a venue now. Like, I tried to book a venue and do a show, they're like, oh, don't let him in, he's a predator. Because AC Flo wasn't allowed to perform anywhere, he decided to take it in his own hands. He put on a story that he'd be performing for his fans at Piccadilly Circus, one of the most packed places in London. I don't know, like, four o'clock, we'll make our way with the speaker. At <laughs> the speaker, like, in the busking section, just, like, let the people do their thing, and then ding do. It's a Bluetooth device as connected a uh, successful light. Yo, I love that one. I love when they use that one. Chrome. Yeah. How are you feeling, man? Okay, then I'm feeling good. A lot of thoughts going through my head. Archie's behind you. How do you think he's feeling? I think he's feeling good, man. Yeah. Like, it's it's intense having to do this. Yeah, I can imagine. But I think it's it's a, a good thing. What's the best case and worst case? Best Slip case up? is there's some fans there, like people that are walking by, interacting well. Archie's looking swag, dancing doing his thing and the worst case scenario is like we stop we start getting like shy or just people who are like trolls that will pull up and start like shouting shit which like we don't really care that much but we'd rather that not happening do you yeah. know what I mean what do you think is going through your brother's mind right now probably similar similar things like that he's probably thinking about you know them drones mm. it, was like a, it was like a tiny one bro and it was like looking at every time I every time I looked at it, it like flew away. He's thinking about something. Yeah. Should we go? Should we go? Summon. How are you feeling, man? We just we got uh, the the Chrome monologue. What about the AC monologue? Hey guys, what's up? It's AC Flow, man. I'm just here to flow with y'all. So pull up. <laughs> we here, and then and then we'll just play baby or something. Yeah, yeah. I can see the smile on your face when you're looking at me, baby. Let's go get this done. Let's do it.
Went to Uber. I think I just got the notification saying it's all good. Should be fine. Sun's out. It's a lot of vitamin D. Sun's Love out. Vitamin D. Out. Big fan of vitamin D. Mm. Big, big fan. Top three vitamins, definitely. Vitamin C is pretty fucking lit. There are more camera lenses in this car than people, I think. There seems to be a protest going on though, there so I don't know. There is definitely a protest going yeah, on. I don't know how... The political prisoner, he set up WikiLeaks. Do you remember WikiLeaks? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Americans are trying to extradite him to America to put him in a high security cell. You know who that is, by the way? Sorry, I don't mean to disturb you. No, is he some rap star or something? Yeah. Who? Uh, AC Flow. AC Flow. Maybe you should tell him about what's, what's going on. Maybe yeah. you could talk about it in his rap so that, yeah. you know. Okay. You want to get a photo of him? Yeah. Should we, let's, let's go over to him. Let's, okay. let's, let's go over to him. Everyone's a flow. So, uh, what's your favorite thing about AC Flow? Wait, how old are you guys? 18. 17. What's your favorite thing about him? Just him in general. He is everything a man can be. How do you like find out about him? I just. Through her. No, you sent me like his TikToks constantly. I'm in a clip. Everyone's a flow. So there's a little predicament, right? There's obviously, I've heard about these dancers, right? Apparently they take bare time. What we might have to do is uh, just blast it right here. Yeah, let's do it. The beautiful people of London. I hope you're all feeling good, man. She's gonna be a dirt. Are you guys AC Flow fans? Uh, we're we're flowing, he's we're flowing. Uh, what are your thoughts are about him? My point, he's a, he's a figure of controversy, I will say that. Do you think it like affects? The music? I think that does affect his music. Like, as much as, like, Figure you think about the guys, like, this, this is some pretty fucked up guy. But you listen to his music, you know what? I have to give it to him. It's all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all right. Everyone's a fly. This is that R. Kelly effect right here. With the early stages of that shit. People disregarding your debaucherous nature and your fuckeries. They'll be like, ah, but the music's not that bad. <laughs> My watching. What in the fuck? I hear you're AC Flow fan. Yeah. How are you feeling? He's, he's literally right there. I know, I'm, I'm a bit scared, but. Well, once he finishes the song, we'll, we'll go and meet him. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, like <laughs> so please play. Please He reading his lyrics off his phone, black. What in the fuck am I watching? Real life Nobody is knows wild. what's going to happen. And then we film it. That's the life whole aquatic concept. in that. Is that we've always done it. Oh, that was it? Yeah, that's the... Uh, Kanan, you got me, Ka. Matter of fact, let me let me subscribe to Ka. I don't know what the fuck this is or what the fuck you be on. I'm, I've never seen that animation either. What the fuck? That's crazy. I'm not seeing that shit ever. Uh, But, yeah, nah, this was just some fuckery. I was like, if I had to go through it, y'all gonna go through it with me. This was a mad one. Uh, Anybody watches it with me, thank you for your time. <laughs> I'll see you on the next one. I'm out of here. Peace.